Hey, good afternoon, everybody on YouTube land. How you guys doing? This is Jim, and it's, uh, what is it today? It's July 25th, 2024, and the time is about uh, 1.40 or so. Anyway, I'm here on the, the treadmill. Let me flip it to the other side. I'm trying, going for, going for 20, sorry, 30 minutes, but, uh, only got a few minutes left to go, so hopefully I can make it. Let me flip it around and show you what's going on. All right, there it is. There's the uh, the clock. Distance isn't too much, like a mile. But it's about 28, so I'll try to go to 30. And in my man cave with my... I got my poker on here, Mike and Molly here. They're on mute now, but uh, yeah, let's let's do this. We'll get there. Only another minute and a half. All right, I'll get back with y'all. Well, everybody, I decided to push it, cranked it up to three for the last three minutes, and I'm going to try to hit 33, which will be a personal retirement record for me. So it looks like I got 15 seconds. So we should get there. Let's see. All right, come on, 33 minutes. Five, four, three, two, one. There it is. There it is. Still going, feeling pretty good, but there it is, 33. All right, hey guys, okay. I'm off that treadmill now. I got my 63-year-old heart <laughs> pounding and pumping. That's good, that was probably uh, very, very good for me. So I'll just keep it up. I'm gonna show you guys some art in a little bit and uh, maybe tell you a story, a hospitality story of one of the many that I have. So I'll, I'll talk to you guys in a minute. Okay, guys, here's the painting I'm gonna show you today. Really not sure how big it is. It's about three feet by four feet, I think. And it's uh, from a long time ago, it's probably 20 years ago. But uh, this painting was done in oil paint. It takes forever for that stuff to dry. But uh, just some kind of mountain scene with some trees and a little path. And uh, hope you enjoyed that. And we're gonna do a weigh-in, as I promised daily to do. And we'll see where I'm at. My wife made um, enchiladas yesterday, so. I had some chips and enchiladas and a salad, so hopefully that didn't. I was at 46, two, I'm sorry, 246 yesterday. Let's see where I'm at today. All right, there it is, guys. All right, everybody, here's my scale. I'm going to hop on that. I was 246 yesterday, so let's see where I'm at today. Two forty four point six. I think I was two forty six point six. So I lost two pounds in a day. Wow, that's crazy. Let me get on that again. That's nuts. I'll probably put it all back on. Well, let's let's stay positive. Two forty four. Up oh, there's two forty five now. Two forty five three. So maybe the scale is not as accurate. But it looks like I lost about a pound since yesterday all right all right guys i'm going to start with that story of me first arriving out in los angeles coming from a small town in iowa and from a from a midwest state in about 1981 or so i think it was right around there but i was about uh i think 20 or 21 years old and i, I got out here and uh didn't have a job didn't have any no money no nothing um Matter of fact, I stopped in Las Vegas and was able to lose most of my money and uh, was able to get my my dad at the time to send me, at the time, uh, my dad to send me um, some money. So they got me some money and I was able to stay with my Aunt Joanne for a few weeks. And uh, I was enjoying her pool. She had a wonderful pool in the backyard and everything, but then I had to get a job 
So I went uh, to the Century Plaza Hotel. It's a very big hotel, um, prestigious hotel in Century City in Los Angeles. And I applied for a job there and I got a job as a greeter at the restaurant. And it was probably not paying much, but I remember um, I was promoted pretty quickly about uh, two or three months into the assistant manager of the restaurant, which I got my first salary back then, back in 1980 or 81, whatever it was. Um, 16,500 now working 15 hours a day managing a restaurant or assistant manager of a restaurant in um, the Century Plaza so I, I had to proceed to um, get a second and a third job so that I could live out here and I got another job at uh, the um, uh, what was it called the the, uh, the sports deli some deli place in Century City across from um, Oh, I can't even remember these places. But anyway, Sports Deli, I got a tending bar job, and then I got another job in a restaurant, um, JTS Brown Saloon, I think it was called, um, waiting tables. So I did that for first year or so, or maybe a little bit longer. Um, and then I'll tell you some more of the story uh, probably tomorrow. We'll go from there. All right, guys, good to see you all today, and I hope you all have a great day.